hello guys welcome back to coding cafe my name is Mohammed Ali and in the previous tutorial we left here okay so we have created and designed this admin category uh, activity and now we have to define and cast these buttons or you can say initialize it on our admin category .java file so what I'm going to do here is that you can simply say private image view and first of all we have t-shirts for t-shirts and then female dresses and sweaters okay so let's do that so t-shirts category okay and then we have sports t-shirts female dresses and then we have sweaters After that we have the glasses, purse, bags, hats, caps and shoes. So we can say glasses, hats and caps. Then we have wallets, bags and purses, shoes, headphones, hand freeze. Then we have laptops, watches, and mobile phones. So yeah, that's it. And let me tell you once again that is, if a user click on this uh, T-shirt, then it basically means that it will uh, display all the T-shirts. I mean, for the users, okay? As you know, now it is the admin panel. When a user click, when an admin click here on this T-shirt then this basically means that the admin can add any kind of t-shirt uh, inside this category okay and the same for the laptops that is apple laptop macbook pro and then dell laptops uh, hp laptops whatever i mean different kind of laptops will be under this category so when a user click on any item from this category okay let's say this laptop then uh, we will send the user to the activity which is called admin add view product activity so first let me write this then we will do that so if a user click on t-shirts dot set on click listener new on click listener so we can create an intent we can give it a name as intent equals to new intent we are on the admin category activity dot this we want to send the user to the add new product activity dot class and we have to pass this category category name which is t-shirts okay to the next activity so then we will allow an admin to add new different products under uh, each and specific category on the add new product activity so we can say intent dot put extra and we will have a category uh, this will be the name so c a t e g o r by category and we will pass the value to it which will be t shirts t s s i r t s t shirts please uh, use the same names okay because if you use different names then you will be com uh, you will be confused in the letter uh, in the upcoming tutorials that is what basically this means so my suggestion for you guys is to use the same names which i am writing here and after that we can simply start the activity for the intent and the same we will do for all these buttons okay i mean uh, the second button is sport t-shirts okay so here we can simply say sport t-shirts dot set on click listener new on click listener and what you're gonna do is to simply copy this intent from here and paste that here and what we gonna do next is instead of this we can simply say sports t-shirts so this is our sports t-shirt category and we will store these values or you can say these variables uh, inside the uh, firebase database and with the help of this we will retrieve these data from the firebase database and the same we will do for the female and sweaters so let's copy paste this and we can simply change this to female dresses 
the user click on that we can simply say female and instead of giving it this name you can also give it some space okay so this will be good okay sports t-shirts and then we have female dresses and now let's copy paste this for these sweaters and the name of this will be sweaters and let's copy paste this the next one is glasses and hats and the caps okay so we can say glasses dot set on click listener and change this to glasses now let's do it for the hats and caps and here we can say hats caps this is the category name and now next one is wallets bags purses okay so here we can say wallets bags and purses then the next one is for the shoes so you can simply say shoes and change this to shoes headphone hand free and then the next one is the laptops so we can simply say laptops first let me check the name of these image views laptops watches and mobile phones so here we can say laptops and change this category to laptops watches change this to watches and then the last one is the mobile phones So we can simply say mobile phones so yeah that's it and what we're gonna do is now go to the admin add new product activity and here we have to receive the uh, value from I mean the category name from the admin category activity okay I mean this thing which we are sending from here so come here and here we need to create a variable of string type which will in which we will store this okay so we can say private string and we can give it a name as category name and now here inside this one create we can simply say category name equals to get intent dot get extra dot get and here we need to pass the same uh, value which is this one okay category so copy this category and paste that here dot to string so this is basically the key you can say okay and this contain a value which is uh, I mean any value that will be this one on which the user will click that is let's say if a user click on sport sports t-shirts then this will pass this sports t-shirts category name here okay and we are storing it inside this category name so for now we are just going to display it in a toast message so that we can see either it is working or not okay so I can simply pass this category name here so yeah that's it and if you remember go to the login activity and here when the admin login we were sending the user to the admin and add new product activity directly so we are not going to send the user there okay first we will send the user to the category activity later on we will also add further new cool functionalities to the admin panel but for now this is uh, necessary okay these are the important functionalities so here you can see when we say if parent uh, name dot equals to admins okay for in case of login so if everything password and uh, user phone is correct when we are sending the user to the admin add new product activity so remove this and here we can simply pass this admin category activity so yeah that's it and now so before we test the app what I'm going to do is first we have to uh, initialize or you can say give a reference to all these image views okay and we forgot to do it at the start 
So here you can see we have set the click list and okay, but first we have to uh, give a reference to all these image views. I mean we have to do it by using their IDs. So what I'm going to do here, I can simply set t-shirts equals to image view. Find view by ID or dot ID dot t-shirts. Let's copy paste this for the remaining ones. So then we have sports t-shirts and the ID for this is by the name sports t-shirts then we have female dresses changes to female dresses then we have sweaters so we can say sweaters and change this to sweaters now let's copy paste this for the remaining ones I mean for the so then we have uh, glasses and it is by the ID for this is glasses okay then we have hat and caps wallets, bags, purses and then then the shoes and now let's do the last one which is head food headphones then we have laptops and the ID for this is laptop PC then we have watches and mobile phones so we can say watches watches and then mobile phones so yeah that's it and now we are ready to test the app so let's run the app so the app is running now successfully let's log in I am an admin and the admin phone number then the password is admin and now let's log in the admin okay so we are on the uh, add category activity okay here are the categories now what the admin will do let's say admin want to add a new product okay under which category laptop let's say uh, macbook pro okay so he will simply click on this laptop icon and here you can see laptops okay and now let's say the admin click on mobile phone any mobile phone so here you can see this is the category name okay and then if a user click on this one so the category name for this is headphone and hand freeze okay headphone and hand free and then for if a user click on shoes and here you can see shoes so what we will do is by using this category name we will uh, the admin will add a new product under each specific category here so we will work, work on that in the next video tutorial and we will allow an admin to add new products different products like that is let's say different laptops hp laptops macbook pro and uh, dell laptops under this category which is for the laptops okay here you can see that so yeah that's it for this video and if anyone is new to our channel then please subscribe our channel called in cafe thumbs up for this video and don't forget to follow me on my twitter instagram and facebook account by this username so yeah take care of yourself and bye for now